What's going on guys? Not a typical video coming here, but uh, we're at Pizza Hut and uh, this is what a $3,300 Pizza Hut order looks like. Now that's, that's, yeah, that's just, that's not impressive. Let's see. So there is not one, but four of these containers. And how many do the tall ones hold, Josh? 10? Okay, so there's 40 right there, just in these big ones alone, those 40 pizzas. And then we've got 28, well, there's 14 there. And then, there's gonna be four of these cars. Right, and then there's four cars in total, not from our store. And then the trunk of the 97, five more bags. And so Pizza Hut in Bowling Springs is also meeting us there because we had to Inman. divide and Inman and and Asheville Highway. So four Pizza Huts are all had to take this order. It was a $3,300 order divided up between the stores. This store alone will be making $700 off of this one order. Holla. So, and this is going to the Upstate College. Josh, you ever taken a bigger order? Can't say I have. You can't say you have. No. Stephanie, have you taken a bigger order? So this is like going in the records, yeah. For this us. Is, this, yeah, for yeah one area. for the books. Yeah, for our area. Yeah. So, I'm gonna close this to keep all the heat in. Keep those things warm. We have to wait until, well my watch is about two minutes fast. We're gonna leave here any minute now. And it's just me, it's just me, Josh, and Stephanie. So, I'm uh, rocking the topper today. And then we'll meet up with uh, the other Pizza Huts. Ready to bounce? Are we ready? Let's go. All right, well, let's get on the road. We'll catch up with you guys when we get there. All righty, guys, 4.45, and uh, we're still on the way to the college. Josh, uh, the guy in front of us, the manager of uh, our location, could have taken this order on his own, and uh, our store could have produced the entire food amount on our own without too big of a problem. The only issue would have been we would have had to come in early this morning to start preparing the food. We would have had to get extra dough and supplies to make the food from other stores, or we would have had to order a larger truck amount. And uh, the truck amount is how much product you order for a week's uh, worth of uh, sales. So, you know, you average out about how many pieces you sell in a day, and then you order your truck accordingly. Well, we would have had to have doubled or quadrupled our truck amount just for this one day. And um, so, we decided, uh, he decided it'd be easier. Um, and they split it up between the four local stores. Um, so we'll see. Like I said, Tim should be the one meeting us from the Bowling Springs, and I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming Clay will be coming from Asheville Highway, and I don't know who's coming from Inman. We don't really associate with Inman that much. I don't anyway, so I have no idea. But we're almost there, so we'll, uh, we'll see this in the future. And we'll catch up with you guys in just a minute. Alright, so we have arrived at SCC. There's Josh and Stephanie. Well, Josh is inside talking to somebody. I guess they're having some type of special event going on. I don't see why you just order $3,300 worth of pizza for no reason. But um, And I'm just chilling here with all this food and my air cranking. And we're waiting on... Josh and when he gets out we have to wait for the other Pizza Huts because you know Pizza Hut at Westgate is the best Pizza Hut ever we're the fastest delivery time on average but you know whatever not saying anything so we just gotta wait for all the other Pizza Huts 
delivery drivers get here. Like I said, I think Tim is gonna be here, so we'll see Tim. He's driving the Burgundy Corolla. I guess he'll be here, I don't know for sure. We'll see what Josh has to say. What's the scoop? Huh? What's the scoop? I'm just waiting on them. I was going to find out where they wanted it all. In there? Yeah. yeah. For the most part. Right. We're going to have to split. When all the stores come together, we're going to have to split evenly to both sides. All right. Now we wait. Some more. Huh? So now we wait. Some more. All right then, so you heard the man, and now we wait. So we are unloading the Dodge, a Jeep from the other store, Corolla, a Kia, a Camry, a Spark, and a Tundra, and a Sentra, I think it is, a new Sentra. These are all Pizza Hut people cars. The inside of there is just slammed full of Pizza Hut personnel. And if I can get in there and get some clips of all the pizza, I will try to do that. It's $3,300 worth of food. It's ridiculous. So we'll see what we can do about getting in there. But anyway, we're unloading now. We're pretty much done. Um, they still have to unload their car and the Sentra and stuff. Other than that, we're good. Do we need to move any of these? Yeah. Them carry those over. Yeah. Got a bunch more. got any more? All right. Now I'm taking a vlog again. Would you like to say nothing else in the vlog? Okay, fine. Mission success. What's this? Every pizza. Have car top Russell. Small winners in needs car toppers. All right, guys. <laughs> Any last words, Josh? That's all it takes. Pizza Hut's largest order in the upstate. Woo! Right now, so far, yeah, we're yep. on there. Next week, we'll get better. Well, well we got to top this now. Yeah. Start. We got to start cutting specials. Somebody call the Methodist College. <laughs> yeah, that's what we'll do. Yeah. yeah. They got a good deal on those. Oh, yeah. All right, to the store. Indeed. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, say awesome as always. And uh, this was Pizza Hut's biggest delivery order. And now, all those young people in there get the pizza that they uh, that they need. And I'm gonna get some fucking air conditioning. Woo! Oh, Josh is leaving me. Oh, good day guys. Good day at Pizza Hut.